Lo que hice fue que lo copié de la pregunta para que ponerlo como exacto, como para que lo reconocieran. Tienen como apóstrofe. Uh -huh. Ok, so now yes, guys. No den copia, ya vino la teacher. <risa> Be quiet. No, ¿Por right. qué le escondieron el bolsón a alguien? <risa> ok, so let me play it once again. Por el libre andaban diciendo por ahí. Come on. I don't know what happened. It goes suck. Okay, como que se, se trabó todo. Okay. So here we go. Let me share my sound. Okay, perfect. Where is it? Um, no, it's not here. I don't know. I think the song is having issues. Sí, el mismo. No, um, it's just loading. Y ese grillo. <laughs> okay, guys. Let's Okay. okay, now I think that yes. So here we go. I think all of us would agree that being healthy emotionally and physically are really important to our overall well being. So, Emily, when you think about a healthy lifestyle, whether it be physically, emotionally, whatever it might be, what would be one or two things that you would think would be extremely important to keep in mind when maintaining a healthy lifestyle? One of the biggest parts of maintaining a healthy lifestyle is self-care. It's not something that's often talked about. A lot of times workaholics are admired and it's something that people will strive to be as a workaholic but as a chronic workaholic i can tell you that it's not it's not something i really enjoy and maintaining self-care and time for yourself is really important and you mentioned about working a lot but self-care and what could be one or two things that you could do for self-care and they could be just some things that are just really simple but you have to put them into your schedule Something that is really important for me for self-care is sitting down and reading a book or watching a movie and just trying to shut off everything else going in my brain. Very key indeed. Okay. What about now? No. Yes. Okay. I can see that some of you said yes, some of you no. Well, so I your... get I get lost in the in the last uh, answer, but I think this answer is not at last. It is middle, but I don't know. In the middle of, of the of the of the uh, conversation. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. Guys. So let me see your scores. Ah. Okay. Was, was it difficult for all of you? Yes. Yes, the last question. It's difficult. Okay. Yes, the last. Eh, ¿Cómo decirlo? Yo me fui por lo por lo lógico. El contexto. El contexto. Tenías que <risa> ver lo que decía y, y ahí es donde tú asocias a la última. Uh -huh. No la dijo tal cual, pero ahí tenías que asociarla. Uh -huh. Yes. Well, okay, guys. Um, well, in this case, you need to try to probably listen to more podcasts, right? 
And using that way, you're going to improve your listening skills by listening to podcasts, right? Daily conversations. If you have, uh, well, you can find those on YouTube, right? Or if you have uh, a Spotify, actually there are many podcasts. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, let's practice with those questions before we go because it's almost time. So guys, some people prefer to be a leader in a group project, while others prefer to be a supporting member in a group project. Which do you prefer and why? Do you prefer to be the leader or do you prefer to support? Uh -huh. And why? I like to prefer a good leader. Why, Glenda? Because um, if my if my heart knowledge about the the project, mm -hmm. I can be the leader. But if I am learning about the project, I want to be a supporter, supporting member. Okay, all right, it is valid. Mm -hmm. And what about the other ones? Do you prefer to be the leader or do you prefer to be a supporting member of a project? I think the same. It depends mm -hmm. because if I if I know the the topic or the project, I prefer. Mm -hmm. I prefer be a leader, mm -hmm. but if I need learn more about the project, mm -hmm. I prefer be a member. Okay, I prefer member. to be. Mm -hmm. I prefer to be. Yes. A supporting member because all the responsibility uh, falls in me. Correct. Yes, falls on me. Okay. Yes. Falls on me. Mm -hmm. That is correct. All right. Well, in my case, I prefer um, I to be a supported member mm -hmm. because uh, I don't like first. I don't like uh, that responsibility for the for the leaders, and I like mm -hmm. to to give uh, ideas mm -hmm. and support the ideas, but always. And the end of the project, always in my case, I convert to the leader. Okay. All right. That is valid as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's move to the other one. Okay. What do you think is, this one is very important. Okay. And I would like to listen to at least three of you. What do you think is the most important quality of a working environment good leaders good colleagues or flexible time good leaders. good leaders why because if uh, the environment have a good leader mm -hmm. uh, the work is more uh, easy, maybe it's easier. it's easier and como fluido and, and smoothly and smooth. Yes, okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, who else? Uh -huh. Which is the most important quality for you guys of a working environment? Mm -hmm. I think that good co colleague, colleagues, colleagues, uh -huh. colleagues, uh, because uh, well, in my case, I like to uh, a lot to work in team, mm -hmm. and I know we have different uh, opinions or different characters, but uh, finally we find the solution, and mm -hmm. like a team, we find 
uh, the the good environment. Okay, so good colleagues. I yes. agree with Carlos. Okay. Good colleagues. Okay. Good colleagues because makes uh, the environment better. Okay. It is valid as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Well, just because of the time, we are going to stop right here. But once again, okay, just remember about uh, the platform. Don't forget about that, please. Okay, tomorrow is going to be our last class. So I will see you back tomorrow at 8 uh, p.m. Okay, thank you for being responsible and connecting. And I hope you have a great night. Take care. Okay, rest. Bye-bye. Good night. 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 Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. See you, Rafael. Take care.